Welcome back to Plans on Planning. Here we are in my personal planner. As you know, we did this lovely spread for the month of July. But now it's time to flip the page and get to the actual week. Yes, even though we do the monthly spreads, we still have to get our weekly spreads going because we got to get some things fine-tuned and finite so that we can get our weeks looking good. And to get this week looking good... Look at the splashy that I have. Super, super cute. I am all about the bows. Please understand. Of course, I know you've seen the bow washi, but this the it's about this size and has a super cute bows on it. I am trying my hardest to get that washi, but I just cannot seem to find it anywhere. Every time I look on Etsy or different shops, they're sold out. So if you got the hookup and you got a link. I need you to hit me with that link. Please, please, and please some more. But I did find this bow washi, and I think it is super cute because, you know, they're bows, and, of course, they're super cute. So we're going to use it to get July started. And to start getting it started, we have to get actually rid of July. Yeah, to get July started, you have to get rid of July. How does that even work out? Talk about that. How does that even begin to work out? All right, so July is gone. It never existed. And we're going to get our washi on and popping. Now, I want to use both of these washies at the top. But as you can see, if I use both of these washies at the top um, by themselves, I lose my second which, of course, means I'm going to lose my six. Now, I know it's Friday, and I still know that it's Monday, but I'm going to try something a tad bit different. Instead of doing the top washi first and then the bottom washi second, I'm actually going to do the bottom washi first and then overlap it with the top washi as opposed to the other way around because I want the bows to shine in all of their glory. So I'm going to go right above the number two and then right above the number six. And then I'm going to overlay the bow washi right on top of that. So if I can find the beginning, we can get started. Here we go. All right. So like I can pull it, but it's not cooperating. <laughs> like the sticky, like my hands are slipping from the sticky. Like it's super... Like, I don't know if you can see when it pulls. Like, it's super freaking sticky. I don't know how to feel about that, to be very honest. Like, I really don't. So, okay. Like I said, I'm going right above the number two. Bam. And then I'm going straight across. Now, covering over this really doesn't matter because we're going to put stickers on it anyway. So, like... Oh, look at the sticky stuff coming up. Okay, it's just, all right, it must have been, like, just to secure the washi itself. All right, so the whole thing isn't that sticky. I guess that's, like, saving grace or something. All right, so we're going to cut that. Oh, let's do the other side. Since I, have, I know I'm, like, super eager to see, like, how it's going to turn out type thing. You know this bright idea of mine all right um let's turn it around you know better safe than sorry type thing just flip it all right i'm still going right above the six there we go knock out any bubbles that may have tried to creep on the scene and then we are going to tear bam all right one down and because i already have it flipped and on this side i'm just gonna go ahead with my bow washi hopefully it cooperates it might not actually it's not going to because of the way the bow is facing so let's go ahead and turn it back around you know washi does kind of ruin my life i basically do what the washi says all right so 
gracious. I'm going to use the top of the page as my guide and just go right across. Actually, let's start with the whole bow as opposed to cutting one off. I mean, it's how like we have to cut anyway. Bam. Ha. Look how cute that is. All right, there we go. And let's cut. Ha. I like it. I like it. I like it. All right, so this one, we're just going to get as close to the rings as possible, the coils as possible. But I'm trying not to hold it down too much, just in case we have some bubbles, as of course we always do. So it gives me an opportunity to like lift it up, get the bubbles out, and still keep it moving. Ha, ha, ha. All right, so I think this came out rather cute, to be honest. And I'm not just saying that because it's my work, of course. But I like it. So, what we're going to do... Oh, cut off the excess on both sides. Bam. And then I'm going to use, like, the golden washi to frame out my days ha 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 all right i have a bunch of washi on my fingers give me a minute all right darn it okay there we go all right so it's pretty nice to start i like it and now we're going to finish off with this washi framing out our days so now i'm using this line as my guide because the washi's that big. There we go. Ha ha. Look at, look at, look at. I still have like washi all over my fingers. Right. It's like little pieces of washi everywhere. Okay. Alrighty. And I'm going to put one out oh, independence day. And I'm going to put one at the bottom. Guess who has finally a day off from work? I cannot wait for uh, 4th of July, Independence Day. Uh, because I don't have to set an alarm that day. I mean, granted, cookouts, barbecues, fireworks, blah, blah, blah. But I don't have to set an alarm. That means I can get up. I can stay up late. Uh -huh. I can stay up late with... No consequences. Binge watch a show on Netflix and not have to like worry about it the next morning. I'll be like super tired when I get into work. I don't have to wake up to an alarm clock. I can sit at home, cook a wonderful breakfast, eat it. You know, let me tell you, things like that are freaking hard to come by. Like to actually have a breakfast. I'm gonna have me a nice, wonderful like omelet or something that day. I don't even know. I'm so like giddy with joy. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. But I just know I don't have to set an alarm. And that's gonna be the highlight of the day. Forget everything else and spend time with family and blah blah blah. I don't have to set an alarm. Why was that so hard to take off? I have no idea. Alrighty. We are almost done. I'm going to put this one right above the notes this time. Just to give myself just a top of my space. Of 
Oh, oh, there we go. Alrighty. So yeah, we're done with the swashy. And now it's time to go to the stick up portion of the show. Ow. All right. So here we are. I actually think it's really, really cute. I love how the colors work together. And my stickers that I'm using, I'm using my um, 365 stickers, the sticker sticker collection. But this one um, has like little kits and I really, really love it. It just takes the guessing work out of it. And this is the one that I picked to go with our washi today. So let's get some sticker in. Um, now, because these stickers are more so made for happy planners and happy planner layouts, that vertical layout, as you can see, I do not have that vertical layout. I actually have the horizontal layout. Um, I kind of got to make the stickers work for myself. So, I like to start from the bottom and go up. Uh, go, please. And do that basically just like this. Um, let's put this. No, it's, I'm not even going to front. It does get a little difficult. I'm trying to line everything up, like, perfectly. But, I like a challenge. Um, I actually want to put it, like, write it down. Right here. And then, oh. Should use another color. I want the color to clash. All right, so let's pull this up. There we go. So I'm gonna put keep it together right here. Oh, that actually works a little better. And then get to work. There you go, which is a little off. So let's try one more time. All right. Yeah, I went a little too far over for this one. Okay, much better, much, much better. Um, I want to put this. And then they write it down. Bam. Works out perfect. Um, I like to put one over here for a little art. Um, important. I put this at the top. Oh, we gotta put the weekend. You know, you always have to celebrate the weekend. The weekend. Bam. Weekend adventure, darling. And let's just. Get crazy with that. With some other stickers. I want to put a schedule. Like right on top of here. And then I have a don't forget. That I want to add as well. Ugh. Actually. I think I'm going to put a don't forget here. And I have a noted. That I can put here. Damn, I like that. Mmm, y'all. 
Yas. All right, now let's just add some other stickers in. We have a today. Far Monday. Let's just, I want to do it this way. Wait, I put it under the Monday though. Alrighty. Bam. Okay, that's super crooked. One more time. Much better. Okay. Um, look at this. A little inspo for the week. She believed she could, so she did. Yes. Bam. That's our goals and inspo corner. I like this wonderful little reminder to be present. And I think that's great for like a Wednesday. This awesome little today. I like this here and now. And then we have happy life. How awesome is that? Now, what we have left are these stickers here. Now, like I said, these things are created for the vertical happy planner layout. I don't have a happy planner layout. So I'm going to just make some little adjustments to these and make them my own or basically for my own use. Just like this. If I could just get it straight. There we go. And I'm just going to cut. And voila. Voila. Oh, actually. Put it right here. Saturday, list going, and then the Sunday list. Some things we want to make sure we don't forget. Um, there we go. Bam. So, there we go. For our weekly spread or my weekly spread for um, the month of July, the first full week of July. God, I definitely love it. Um, I think it came out quite nice. I think it's rather cute and lovely and it will definitely suffice and get me through the week. And thank you ever so much for joining me here and getting my week together with me. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, feel free to um, comment below. And if you don't feel comfortable actually commenting, you can always send me an email. I am more than happy to talk to you and I definitely, of course, am going to respond. And also, please, please, please do not forget to go ahead and follow me on social media. Then slide in my DM and let me know that you saw the video. So... Until I hear from you, I will see you next time. Bye-bye. All right, all right, all right.